Boys and girls, I'm in my darkroom and I'm fiddling around with some of that Thornton 2 bath developer. I thought I would see how well uh, the x ray film would develop in it. So I've got some x ray film, I ran one through already, and uh, with at the recommended times of four and a half minutes in each bath. And uh, the negative is very robust, actually probably too robust, especially the stairs. This part here, it's very, very dense. So I have another sheet and I'm gonna try that uh, with reduced time in A and B. So probably bath A, I'll do like two minutes, two and a half minutes. And bath be the same, two and a half minutes. We'll see what happens. Yeah, let's do it. That's the second sheet. And it's not as, I don't know if you can see it. Can you guys see? Sort of. Yeah, it's much less dense, denser. So that's good. I think I'll experiment more with two and a half. My shadows look really good. So I'm gonna continue washing these negatives and uh, hang them up to dry and then I'm gonna look at them more closely. Catch you guys later. Ta-da! Here are the two negatives. This is the first one that I processed in Thornton 2 bath, uh, where it received four and a half minutes in both baths, bath A and bath B. And this is the second one that I ran through with reduced time, um, two and a half minutes in bath A and the regular four and a half minutes in bath B. And you can see they are very different as far as uh, D-Max goes. Look how dense the, the stairs are. Right? It was a snowy day, so it's the most reflectance. Refl highest reflectance was in the snow, on the snow on the branches. And you can see it's less dense here with reduced time. The shadows aren't deep shadows where I metered, aren't too bad. It's a little bit thinner than it is on this one. So I'm going to check them, check the densities with my little densitometer here. We'll zero that out. Let's do the uh, really dense negative first. So let's check the base plus fog, zero, 
4.4 a.m. It's a little bit higher than normal. Okay, let's measure the snow on the stairs. Really dense. Looks up on the, in these areas here. Let's check that. 2.04. That's pretty dense. Let's check the shadows. 0.33. That's actually pretty darn good. That's a, a good density for my zone 3. 0.31 in there. I think that's the thinnest area. So that's a density range of about 1.73, which is actually pretty good, actually, for carbon. Let's check the densities of the second sheet. Base goes fog, 0 0.34, 0 0.33, and that bright area on the stairs there. 1.48, 1.51, so 1.51, and my shadow zone 3 reading, 0.24, it's a little low. Point two two. so that's a density range of about 1.29, which is a little low for Calotype, but I think I can still squeeze one out.